Hello, I'm Ghost the Keeper of Night here with the Twisted Twins on The Ghost Show. My name's Ghost, and this is my show. Thank you for having us. This is actually our first time in a live interview. No. Okay. Seriously, first time on a live interview? Yep, you have the Ghost exclusive. Where did Dead Hooker in a Trunk begin? We had the foolish idea of not wanting to act anymore because the roles being offered to us were pretty piss poor. So we thought, f*** it, I like doing stunts. We had our martial arts background and we went to a film school that had an amazing stunt program. There is a dead body in the trunk! And our final project was a short film and we decided to do a faux trailer and we did a faux trailer for Dead Hooker in a Trunk. But they had no money left over for us, which was kind of supposed to be part of our tuition. Last night is really fuzzy right now. But we said, it. no, I'm going to do it on our own. We did it with our own resources, on our own time, bringing in our own cast and crew. So now what? We take her into the woods and we bury her. How the hell did you find a horse to drag you? <laughs> Hi, tension free! That horse's name is Libero. He's owned by the amazing Cat Thompson. If you're in Vancouver and you need a stunt horse, doing a drag like that is super f- difficult. Yeah! 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 The horse ran off with me. The, the horse didn't run off with me as much as the actor on it thought I was a f- and wanted to teach me a lesson. So I lost five inches of skin. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my gosh, okay, so I wasn't allowed to do the horse drag in the future. I was just dragged by a truck. Isn't getting dragged by a truck worse than getting dragged by a horse? Like, it sounds worse. That's what I thought. Well, there was so much stuff to make sure was set up for the day. And then I go there and I have my my harness on, my knee pads, I'm in my costume. I got this lasso around my uh, wrist tied to a truck and the, the entrance starts and they're like, are you ready? And I'm like, oh, this is really stupid. Yeah, no, everything's okay. I just have to help my friends out with something. Uh, So I just love shopping and I lately discovered that you have a store. Tell us a little bit about it. Well, actually, Ghost, we have a little something for you. For me? (gasps) Yeah. Thank you. Oh! (gasps) Dead hooker in a trunk bumper sticker, (gasps) t-shirts, and it's my size women's. The women's ones fit sexier, yeah, so they, I thought you'd want to, you know, sexy it up. It's true. My name's uh, Charlie Lawton. I'm the public relations manager for Toronto Underground Cinema. And have you heard of the Twisted Twins before? I have, yes. Well, we would love to screen their films here and maybe show their trailers. What do you think? Yeah, I already have the trailer for the newest film. What? <gasps> but it, it's not even released yet. How did you get it? We have ways, Underground. <gasps> we have ways. Let's play that trailer. I wanted to be a surgeon for as long as I can remember. The specialty is known to drag people with a god complex, but that's not me. My vices include red wine, poverty, lust for my professor, and an obsession with personal perfection. However, most people would say this little passion has secured me a nice warm spot in hell. This has to be a little secret, but this is for the fans. This is a honest to goodness f- horror horror movie it follows medical student mary mason as she grows increasingly broke and disenchanted with her uh medical school and the surgeons she once admired and the allure of easy money and notoriety in the underground world of surgeries sends uh, mary into a very uh, new darker occupation than she originally intended and we have the wonderful Catherine isabel playing mary mason i f-ing love her she's She's so f-ing talented and she's drop dead gorgeous everywhere you see her. So she's uh, she goes through hell in this. You could call me a monster, but whoever said surgeons can't be a little creative. I think after American Mary, people are going to look at us and horror a completely different way. And I know everyone says that about their film, but American Mary is really going to kick the horror community in the balls in a nice way. Woo! Yes, I can't wait. When's it coming out tomorrow? It's beginning to shoot at the end of October and it'll be out before the end of the year. 
Thanks for watching The Go Show with the Twisted Twins. Until next time, happy nightmares. The gore is done by Masters Effects, the guys behind True Blood and Six Feet Under. We actually have legitimate real stuff happening in the movie. You'll see when you see the actual movie, so you won't be able to tell if the gore is real or is simulated in this, which is a big f it, it, I love it. It, it. You can get your gore load right on the screen. You're gonna f love it. I just dropped my bag and a whole bunch of syringes just fell out of it. <laughs> can you buy these in your store too? Yes, you can and they're really popular with airport security. They're always like, oh, is it a real needle? I'm like, oh no, it's just a pen. <laughs> TwistedTwinsProductions.net and there's a little button and it says contact. You can talk to us. We'd love to f hear from all of you. The only two uh, emails we don't respond to are f me and make me famous. I don't know how to do either.